So you are having a conversation with somebody, and they've changed the subject entirely, and just expect you to know what they are talking about. This is every conversation I have with my father. As a child, I looked up to my dad as an extremely powerful person who always seemed to know right from wrong. His ability to fix anything after just a glance, it made him stand out more than anything. Also, when times were tough and my mother couldn't provide for us, he protected my brother and I, making sure we had everything we needed. My father, being someone that has taught me everything I know, along with how to interact with others, I feel my father is the perfect topic for this speech because of the role he has played in my life and being a person that has influenced me greatly. My father, being a person that immenses himself in everything he comes across, he knows way too much about what seems like everything and everything there is to know. That is for being a school psychologist anyway. Working as a single parent for a great majority of my life and having very limited money as far as my father's outlook on problems of the world, I think if you gave the man a little bit of time and some funding, he could probably fix a few of planet Earth's problems. Instilling this mindset in me, one of the things my father has said that has stuck with me the most over the years is the more you know, the more you know you don't know. As a younger child, dad always was more excited than us on Christmas. This was because he got my brother and I a steam engine every year. It probably sounds really weird. Why would a little kid enjoy something that you can just sit and listen to it and watch it run? But my brother and I were intrigued. These little engines ignited an interest in mechanics and gave me an outlet to figure out how they worked. Um, my, fa my father and I would regularly escape to my workshop, escaping a more intense and emotionally unstable environment. The time Dad and I spent in the shop was always time well spent, time for me to absorb knowledge, watching my dad work. If he wasn't working on something for somebody else, he would often do projects with me. For instance, we made marble runs and other artistic things. If it wasn't for the, my dad introducing me to things, pushing me and expecting me to figure things out on my own. I wouldn't know half of what I do now, or for that matter, have developed the interests I have today. As a young kid growing up, life was great. My family was close, but there was always a great tensity between my mother's family and mine. Soon, around the end of fifth grade, my mother's mental health began to fail. Making my father work extra hard to make sure we had everything we needed. Despite the massive load and lack of sufficient income, my father still protected us and provided, with, provided us with the necessary items my brother and I needed. In this time, I learned by watching my dad some importance of, some level, importance of a level of self-sufficiency. What I mean by that is when anything, anything in our household broke, I would observe as he tore the back off the washing machine and replaced a faulty drum bearing, or he pulled the belt off our treadmill that needed to be replaced. My dad, being able to do all these things successfully, really helped me see the importance in things many of us take for granted. My dad and the role he has played in my life really has helped mold me into the person I am today. Dad's knowledge gave me the ability to constantly learn and have very intellectual conversations, always sprouting new ideas. I can thank my dad for most all of my hands-on experiences with anything engine-related, even though now I could probably outsmart him. And for the humble thought process to never think there's nothing left to learn. Lastly, I thank my father for being a rock-solid person and always being there keep us occupied, protect us, and give us the attention we need. My father is a person indescribable by words, and I hope that all of you have someone in your life of the same meaning my father is to me.